Yeah, I think it was Dragonborn DLC that added in like a level 80 dragon or whatever. Like the Ancient Dragon or Elder Dragon or some shit like that. Some just really fucking old ass dragon. I mean, they're all pretty old, right? They're all old in some way. But this one, oh my god. This one just like pees all night long, always getting up to go pee. This one? <laughs> this dragon? You know this dragon's fucking tough. It had fucking like 500 different colonoscopies, dude. This dragon is like tough as shit. People have been looking in this dragon's butthole for like 500 years. Good God, that is one strong, powerful dragon. I've seen that dragon's butthole. That's how strong it is. <laughs> I'm not even a doctor. <laughs> All right. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Let's get over here. <laughs> Before this dragon hears me and is like, You're talking about my anus? When we had last left, the last dragonborn, they had traveled out to the Golden Glow Estate. There it was that the Thieves Guild had tasked them with sending a terrible message to the owners. Yes, a terrible message for betraying both the Thieves' Guild and Maven Blackbriar. Ma er, Maven, I guess. Yeah, she's a Maven. <laughs> Maven of her own Mead Empire. And there did they send a most terrible message indeed. With flame and sneaky lack of shoe, did they slunk around the estate and burn the beehives there. They also broke into a safe of some sort and took some junk inside of it. And now they were ready to return to the Thieves' Guild to see not only what else they had to offer, but to look forward to other further adventures. This is the Elder Scrolls V Skyrim. Welcome back. Boom. There we go. <laughs> Jeez, this thing looks so scenic. Look at the lighting on that, huh? Even during the day. Jeez, this little light here, it makes it look so, so dope. All right. And honestly, for the best, because this is a, although it's kind of in the back of the city, this is a frequented area, right? You get a lot of foot traffic here if you're a member of the Thieves' Guild. So you want to kind of have it look nice, even though it's meant to be secluded like back alleys and all that, right? All right. Anyway, <laughs> jeez, you know what? I should mention, I spent like... <laughs> I don't know, about three hours doing <laughs> clerical work. You know, I said I would do enchanting and all that shit. So let's see here. I wrote down exactly what I did. Whoops, dinged my mic there a bit. So I'd gotten one level in all three of our main attributes, Magicka, Health, and Stamina. I think I'd like to get Stamina up to 250 as well. I don't know. I think I'd like to do that. And then maybe we'll just keep doing health. I'm not sure. We, nah, we'll probably get Magicka to 200. Keep Stamina at 250. And then after we have Magicka at 200, we'll just pump all of our remainder points into health forever. Maybe that's a good idea, right? We'll see. Anyway, what I did pick up here is... Let's see. And I know it was about three hours because I, I put on a podcast that had a runtime of about that much. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking ridiculous, right? It's it's such a different feeling from Oblivion, right? Let's see. Anyway, let's go on over here. And let's see. I got... Yeah, I got one point in Enchanting. Or Enchanter, I should say. And then I got Arcane Blacksmith, which will come in handy. There we are. Super duper useful. I did improve the majority of my gear. And got it fully kitted out and enchanted just as well. Let's see. And then, finally, I got a point in Armsman. So now we're up to 80% bonus. Pretty nice. Now, over here, with our equipment itself, I enchanted our exquisite Ebony War Axe. And this actually has a little over, I think, 209 charges. So whenever our Soul Sap procs, we'll get about... We'll get at least 10 swings worth, right? So... Should be pretty good, right? Should be pretty good. It'll, it'll come in handy against weaker enemies and all that. And I have been thinking maybe against weaker enemies, we let them hit me so I can level up uh, heavy armor more. Speaking of heavy armor, I did enchant and upgrade the majority of my shit here. 
Not the steel, though, because I, I totally ran out of steel shit. I just used all that. And you can see I've still got shit I need to sell off. All right, still got plenty of that. But I got a new necklace, 15%. Magicka resist. Let's see. Oh, I need to unequip that smithing ring. <laughs> I've got a ring as well that does similar. Let's see. Where is it at? There it is. Yeah, 15% as well. Magicka resist on the ring. So we're at 30% cumulative, and then another 15 when we put on our shield. Pretty good. And then our standard armor. Increase heavy armor by 10 points. Block, 25% more. Magicka regen, 26%. We don't yet have... Uh, we don't yet know the most amazing enchants to put on this, but I figured, hey, why not? Especially since now we have access to improving that stuff, right? Anyway, we're going totally the wrong direction. We need to go down into the Thieves' Kill and turn this shit in, right? Actually, while, while it's day out, let's go to the docks. You know what? We were on we were on the right path there. Let's go to the docks and see if we can talk to what's-their-butt. A few folks also wrote in. I Sorry. Totally forgot to... Amid all of the crafting, totally forgot to write down names this time. But a few folks wrote in saying that, yes, the quest where you earn the ability to buy the honey home? Is it called? I forget. But whatever it's called here, the home in Riften. There's another Argonian down here by the docks. What does the Dragonborn do once he's been summoned by the Greybeards? Can the Thum be taught? Like any skill? Oh, I don't know, but look at this! Poof! It's me! Why? Well, he doesn't give a shit. <laughs> All right. Wow, it's substantially more gray out here on the docks than inside Riften itself. Jeez, look at this. The weather has just gone to hell immediately. Oh my god. Okay. Oh, there you are. Mm -hmm. From Deepest Fathoms. What do you have? Mm -hmm. Tidings. Wow, she doesn't what give do a need? shit. Okay. Let's see. You got anything good on you, though? Let's take a look at this. Ooh, also, we have a necklace, don't we? In fact, that's all we have is the necklace. <laughs> My bad. There we are. No, you just have a belted tune. I used to be. There we are. How about you? No, nah, nothing really like either. You. Then I took an arrow in the. Wow, knee. that's our first time hearing it, huh? We're like 35 videos into this. Finally, we've heard it. Holy shit! Very first time. Wow. Someone put that on the calendar. Achievement unlocked or some shit. Good God. <laughs> <laughs> Let's check out the fishery. I don't Please remember. Help me. I'm going to lose my job at the Riften Fishery. Oh, God, why? No. I really need your help. I don't want to lose my job at the fishery. What am I going to do? I don't know. What do you need? What can I do? Do you, do you need me to kill someone? <laughs> Let's see. Hey, do you like working at the Riften Fishery? She'll be like, I just told you I'm going to lose my fucking job. It doesn't matter. <laughs> Bully is a good man. He pays us well and watches out for us. Well, except for the whole I used to work at the Black Briar Meadery, but Indarin and I never saw eye to eye. That elf has no patience at all. Damn. It's probably for the best anyway. I'm far better at fishing than working in a meadery. Hmm. You might lose your job? My job at the Riften Fishery is in danger. The owner, Bolly, said that if I show up for work in this condition one more time, then I'm out. What condition I is that? I don't mean to do this to myself, but I can't help it. I tried some skooma a year ago, and ever since then, I can't stop. Oh. If you could give me a healing potion, I could cleanse this poison from my body and get back to my life. Jeez. All right, sure, here you are. I'm pretty sure I've got like a million of them. I just craft like so many. Your kindness will never be forgotten. It probably has to be like a specific here, one, though. Here, take this. It's all I can offer you for what you've given me. Yeah, potion of healing. Okay. Identify Rift and Skooma dealer. It is our most favorite company. Oh, hey. I'm feeling much better now, thanks to you. Hey, what is Skooma? What, what is this? I'm not sure what it's made from, but I can tell you that once you've had a taste, you'll never crave anything else. <laughs> the Dunmer came up with the stuff a long time ago. Very illegal and very hard to come by. It was the Dunmer who invented it? I got mine off a ship in solitude. Worst mistake I ever made. Huh. Part of me wonders if... If Dunmer a long-ass time ago specifically engineered skooma to be... Well, of course, addictive. It's addictive to everyone. But to be especially addictive to 
Khajiit and maybe Argonians, right? As a way to like placate them, right? Like if we're to get really fucked up and dark about it, do we think that this is a, a potential re reality? I mean, certainly <laughs> there is talk of similar things in real life happening. <laughs> All right, do you get your skooma? Where do you get your <laughs> Where do you get your skooma? Look, I don't think I should say. I mean, they could kill me. I think you owe me one. <laughs> Here, does this help? And who says I won't? Okay, never mind. Hmm. Well, if I just give you some money, that's. I feel like this is the the best thing, right? <laughs> I mean, obviously we can get information all these ways, but I feel better about just giving her money. Here, does this help? Okay, okay, I'll tell you. I get my skooma from Sarthas Idrin. He has some sort of a setup over the Riften warehouse. You can't get inside, though. They've kept that place locked up tight since the war began. Hmm. Who has a key to the warehouse? I overheard Boli say that only the Jarl carries the key to the warehouse. Really? When I meet Sarthas there, he's usually waiting for me outside with his bodyguard. Huh. Well, what will you do now? Probably just keep fishing, right? If it wasn't for Skuma, I'd already be on my way out of this horrible city. Oh, I thought you liked working at the fishery. All my gold. Completely gone. Now I have to start over. I'll never use Skuma again. Although I suppose a little mead now and then would be harmless. <laughs> Fuck, I mean, why not? The fucking Nords sure drink like millions of gallons per day. <laughs> You've been kind. I thank you. All right. Hey, look, we can actually get some fish here, too. Wow, is this just free to take now that we've helped her? <laughs> Does she just not mind? Look, wow, so many fish. Oh, the fishery is amazing. All right. Oh, look. Business ledger, a salmon steak. Okay, sure. I like this. Oh, look, things to do. Huh, things to do. One, repair holes and nets. Sending mar car sending to Markarth, too expensive. Look for a local solution. Valandor, perhaps? Two, repair wood damaged on fish pens. No skill required for this. Should simply have Wujita take care of it. Three, adjust fishing charts for Lake Honrich. Need to keep ship clear of Golden Glow Estate. They took pot shots at our ship last time we moored within a stone's throw of their location. No idea why, and letters to Erangoth have gone unanswered. To where? Lake Honrich. Oh, Golden Glow Estate. Oh, right. Huh. Maybe because they thought that they were like a Thieves Guild operative or whatever, right? <laughs> it must have been because right then they write in the the missive that we found there at the estate like oh shit take my advice and uh, bump up your security four tell Nivenor to stop spending so much of our damn money okay pirate king of the Abishan oh shit that sounds dope as hell okay let's take some steaks good Olaf and the dragon good 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 should I just I'm grab some fish? Now, thanks to hmm. I'm just gonna eat these scales. Resist frost. Sure thing, friend. Let's see. Should we harvest these salmon? I think so. Look, this is just free food here, dude. This is great. Valandor. Well met. I don't think they're hiring anyone at the moment. So if you're looking for work, you're out of luck. Oh man, that's a shame because I'm real fast at, <laughs> at harvesting fish. I can do it like instantly by just looking at it. It goes right into my Trees. pocket. Trees, they're beautiful here. Reminds me of autumn at home. They, they are beautiful here. Gosh, that line makes me want to see uh, Valenwood and all the that fall shit, Fall forest right? makes me miss my childhood. Oh. Playing among the towering trees in Valenwood and living with my brethren. Oh. Seeing the sorry state of this city oh, he almost doesn't makes have... me regret okay. my decision to leave my home when my apprenticeship completed. Hmm. Okay. So this is where they, like, mate the fish and, and like, catch them and shit. Okay. Oh, well, let's just do some of this. Get all these salmons. Mmm. What do you think? There's a... What, what do you think the odds are there's some skeletal remains in here? <laughs> that would be some Elder Scrolls shit, huh? Like a skull or like a rib cage down here. Hmm? Anything? Wow, honestly, I, I'm starting to think that there might not be. Which would be the greatest fucking twist of all damn time. Oh my god. 
I don't think there's a dead body in here at all. What? <sighs> Man, I thought for sure there would be a dead body. All right. I Fair was enough. fortunate enough to be guided by one of Sylvanar's master armorers until he passed. And we're never gonna need. Wow! Look at all this. Holy shit! Fish barrels. They're full of shit. Oh my god. Oh. My mind's being blown by fish. Let's take some more. Oh, I'm getting hungry just looking at them. All right. Anything else? More fish barrel. Oh, look, a mud crab chitin. Take all that. I don't think I have a, a way to cook up this, um, this clam meat. <laughs> right? I'm feeling much better now, thanks to you. Oh, sure thing. Okay. I think we got everything. Cool. And a lot of these will repopulate, too, right? Because these are harvestable. After a certain point in time, we could come back in here. The fish barrels as well, right? Dope, dope, dope. Okay. Let's see. Maybe that was the person that we were meant to look out for. Ujita? No lollygagon. Let's see. Carrots. I'll just eat these. Delicious. Okay. Back into the fishery. Fathoms. Let's see. What is this place? The Blackbriar Meadery. I don't think I've ever gone inside of the Blackbriar Meadery. Who's this? Maul. Dirge told me you made it into the guild. Oh. You need dirt on anything, you talk to me. Oh, right, I forgot about you. Hey, tell me more about the Blackbriars. Well, you got Maven. She pretty much runs the whole operation. She's got friends in high places, if you know what I mean. She's also got ties to the Dark Brotherhood and the Thieves' Guild. So basically, no one can touch her. Just remember, if she tells you to do something, you damn well better do exactly what she says. Hmm. I do wonder who, who like, because the, they say that she's got friends in high places, even relative to her, and she's already like a noblewoman, right? <laughs> so who could it be? Hmm. Any news involving the Dark Brotherhood? The only thing I heard is a rumor that a boy named Aventus Aretino in Windhelm has been attempting to contact the Dark Brotherhood. He used to live here in Riften at the orphanage on the other side of town, but I think he ran away. Can't say I blame him. Hmm. All right. Oh, I guess we already heard about that. Slip up Didn't and I'll get an cut you like a fish. Jeez, take it easy, Maul. Jeez, jeez, jeez. All right. So we need to lift a key off of... Fuck, I guess the Jarl, right? Unless they keep it in one of these sacks here. I mean, why would they do that? That seems real dumb. <laughs> oh, do you think there's, like, lower access, maybe? Ooh, let's scope it out. Look, this is here. Maybe this means something. Nordic Barnacle Cluster? <laughs> this can only mean good things. Let's see. Do you think they have, like, some kind of weird poop shoot? Perhaps. Catching all sorts of fish. Man, this fish shit is great. <laughs> all right. Anything? Or maybe, like, a little tiny box or something that I could look into? No, nothing. Oh, that's a bummer. All right. Fair enough. Let's go lift the key off of the Jarl. Here we are. Should probably eat something just as well. Okay. Too bad Maul doesn't know about it, right? Yeah, he I'm looks like he knows. <laughs> He's standing right outside of it, right? A Thieves Guild member right outside of like a skooma manufacturing plant or whatever you would call it. Skooma den. Okay. Over here. Here we are. Whenever we go to look at the inventory of these vendors out here, we'll, whenever that comes up, we'll see we'll see some of the shit that I've sold to them. <laughs> Just like these weird ass enchanted necklaces and rings. Good lord. Surely they get rid of that stuff at some point though, right? Oh look, where's she gone? Oh, there she is. Okay. I know you. Where was it? Let's see. Let's double check, make sure I've still got deft hands. Yep. Oh. Okay. You were getting where is it? Oh, shit, it's not here. Huh. Necklace of the Squire, though. Hmm. Okay. Something for me. Weird. How come she doesn't have it? A Nuriel confiscate, confiscated goods key? Hmm. Oh, look. I would love to have that ring of minor wielding, though. Jeez. Okay, you know what? I'm going to 
I could pop a potion here. Right? Potion of stealing, or whatever it's called. Though maybe I sold it off. I may have sold it off. Haggling. Strength pickpocketing. Yeah. Hmm. Though we don't really know who the hell has it. The actual item we need. Here, let's double check this. Oh, I don't even have a quest. Oh, weird. Huh. Yeah, I don't even have a quest to go check it out. Get away from me. Okay. Jeez, take it easy, dude. Is Serlin the dude? It was someone with an S name. Hmm. Lockpicking? No. Though there's a lot of good people we could hit in here. <laughs> Honestly. Welcome to Mistvale Keep. I'm Jarl Layla's steward, Anuriel. Hmm. Yeah, who do we hit up we for this shit? Appointment? No. It was a delivery? I can't remember. Let's see. No, you don't have it either. Burr. Get away from Alright. Fair As enough. Rift and steward, I'm afraid I can provide only limited Weird. assistance. How do we get into the the Skuma warehouse? I thought we had gotten a quest for it. Right? I thought we had some kind of pop-up. But I suppose not? Hmm. Return the Queen Bee statue. Search it. Eh. Report Sathis. Sarthus Idrin to the Jarl of Riften. Oh. Okay. So we we can just snitch. We can't actually go in there. Maybe I want to meet with him, though. I presume you're right? bothering me. Let's see. Where is he? He hangs out over here. Maybe I'll cut a deal with him instead of fucking snitching like a little weasel. <laughs> All right. We can get this the Thieves Guild in on it. Over here. Aaron's... Bali's house. Maybe Bali's got a key, right? Where does this fucking dude live? Hmm. Helga's bunkhouse? No. Honeyside? Yeah, that's the name. Alright. Let's bring up our map. Our local one. Maybe we can see the door. Oh, shit. Sensitivity is off the chain. Okay. Orphanage. Romulan Dreth. Hall of the Dead, Temple of Mara. Oh, jeez. Elixirs, Riftwield Manor, Snowshod, Aaron. Yeah, where the fuck does this dude live at? Maybe he's been in Helga's? Maybe he stays here? As a worker? At the bunkhouse? Let's see. Was he one of the horny guys? He may have been. Let's see, over here? No, he wouldn't be down. He'd be up here, wouldn't he? If he were anywhere, snoozing or something. No, nobody here. Everyone's left. Weird, where is this dude at? I want to look inside that place. Huh. Alright. Especially before I decide to report his fucking crime. Let's see, where would this fucking dude be at? Oh, is this him? No, Working Titus at the Riften Fishery is tough, but it puts some coin in my pocket. Huh. This guy. Can I interest no. you in some fine goods from Morrowind? Where the fuck does this guy hang out at? Visiting Riften? All are welcome at the Temple of Mara. Yo, this guy has like gone missing. City's quiet enough now, but when the sun goes down. Where the fuck does he live? <laughs> All right, fuck it. I'm going into Bali's house. F it. Let's go on over here. Bali's house. I'm ready to go in. Oh shit, someone can detect me. It's probably that card right there. Alright, fair enough. Can we sneak around the back and get in that way? Is there a back What's entrance? The hurry? I'm trying to break and enter, Ilya. That's why. That's why we're in such a hurry. I'm trying to do a little breaking and entering. No, there is no rear entrance. Oh shit. I definitely remember breaking into one of these houses for the Thieves Guild. I definitely remember that. Man, this guy's just missing in action. Where the fuck's he hang out at? Let's see. Steal from barrel? Salt pile? No. Shit, shit, shit. I want to get in there, dude! Hmm. Where would he be at? Maybe the inn? Let's check the inn. My food is the best in Maybe he hangs out in here and does like day drinking or if some shit. Got the coin? You've come to the right place. Pull up a seat. Hey, have you seen what's his name again? 
Sarthus Idrin? Where the fuck is he, dude? Oh, it's you. Does he Not own a room problem, here? That he's always snoozing in? No? Not in here. Let's just pop these doors. Taylor. No. Nope. I think you've had Over plenty here. Oh shit. You should head on home. Okay. Whose fucking room is this? Oh, this is their their main one, right? If we want to do some Stupid sort of lizard. crime shit. I said give yeah. me some more drink. Alright. I'll have your head on a bike. Man, I wish Suit I could just yourself. like punch that guy in the fucking noggin. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Been in Riften for quite some time now. Let's Lady see. Yoke. Down this way. I fear that you soon may leave us. If your allegiance yeah, lies with the yeah, Empire, this dude's fucking gone. He like skipped out on town. He knew. You have some. Hey, Mercurio, you made it back. What you did to Kirava. Oh shit! Sorry. <laughs> Let's get out of here. <laughs> All right. Where the fuck does this man live at? Does he like work at the Blackbriar Meadery or something? Hey, I'm the brewmaster around way. here. Who are what you to you judge me? Oh shit. What's his name again? Sarthus Idrin. Welcome. Allow me to recommend the Black Briar Mead, the purest brew in all of Skyrim. Okay, okay. <laughs> Let's take it easy there, pal. Is this dude in here? Sorry, I'm afraid Another I can't help you much right now. Wow, look at all this. Wow. Yeah, I don't think I've ever really came in here and looked around. Jeez, oh, this... You look like you could use a drink. Me. What do you say to some cheap mead? Where does this dude hang out at? <laughs> He's nowhere to be seen. Oh, my God. We're never so going to get an entrance. I, have a problem. I know how to deal with it. Whoa, what's your problem? Mara Mal thinks he's so smart. Tells me that Mara will cleanse the filth from my blood. Huh. What does he know? Oh, is she doing Scoom Scoom too? I'm quite busy. Need something? Can I get back to work? What the fuck? All right, let's head on out. Where is this dude? Have I ever even seen this man? Let's see. Oh, it's you. No. Come to extort more Snilf? from me. Is this working him? at the Rift Fishery? Is no. tough, but it puts some coin in. What the pocket. fuck? <laughs> this guy is gone. He's out of here, man. Where does this man live? Leather? Fuck it, we're just gonna report the fucking crime. Look. <laughs> the ultimate betrayal. Sorry, Ilya. <laughs> okay, we'll head on over here. Maybe Maven knows? What in the name of Oblivion do you want? What if we just say this? How did you become allied with the Thieves Guild? Hey, how, how'd you do that? The Blackbriar family wow. has always been allied with the Guild. Our connections with the Empire and within Skyrim make for a perfect fit. I dare say the Guild owes its survival as much to my family as it does to its own people. I thought she would be like, shut the fuck up. Your name carries weight in Riften. Of course. Nothing gets done without my approval in this city. I have the Jarl's ear and the guards in my pocket. Anyone makes trouble for me and I pay a visit to the Thieves' Guild. Make me angry and I contact the Dark Brotherhood. You do well to remember that the next time you make such a stupid observation. <laughs> Great. Cool. Okay. I believe we're done. Let's head on up here. Man, where the fuck does this dude hang out at? There isn't... Maven Blackbriar doesn't have, like, a spouse or whatever, right? Huh. All right. What's up? What can I do for you? I've discovered a skooma dealer in Riften. Yes, I'm afraid we're aware of Sarthus's presence in the warehouse. Unfortunately, we're certain he has informants within the city guard. Every time we've made a move to arrest him, he's escaped. However, if you take care of this discreetly, you might be able to surprise him without warning. Sure, I'll do it. Excellent. Here, this is the key to the warehouse. Oh. See if you can drop in on this dealer of poison and convince him to close down his operation permanently. Okay. What do you... You want me to kill him? <laughs> Good journey to you. Alright, let's head on out of here. Here we are. Okay, so I guess he doesn't ever show up in town, right? 
because the, the dude who I was thinking of, his name was like Andre Andrean or something like that, right? Okay, over here, and then run on over this way. Yeah, we really should be able to like cut a deal with him and get like the thieves guild to be a part of his his group. Like we could extort him or something, right? What is it, dragons? What? I fucking hope not. I think it's just a foggy day out. <laughs> I like it. This dude's just like on high alert. Just like, fuck, I heard that there's dragons now. What the fuck? <laughs> I mean, Riften did get attacked earlier, so fair enough. Okay, let's do a quick save here. In we go. Knock, knock. Ha, oh, found fuck. You. Jeez. Ah. Oh, fuck. Ah. Whoa. Ah. Whoa. Ah. Whoa. Ah. Whoa. 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 Ah. Shit. Fuck me. I'm getting hungry and shit. All right. Jeez, 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 jeez. Let's eat some soup. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> All right. Should I have some potion action going on? Yes, I should. Potion of healing again. All right. Jeez. Couldn't even talk to him. There you go. Eat shit, dude. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Good job. Oh, jeez. Alright. Recover skooma source information. Man, we made a mess of this place. Hey, maybe... You know what? Why cut a deal with them? Let's take it over. Why can't I run a skooma den? Fuck, I want that, dude. I want to run the skooma den. I don't want to... Fuck this, I'm in the empire business, baby! Why should I be reporting crimes? Look, we wiped out a whole skooma den! No one has to know. We'll start running it. Maul's just outside. Whisper in his ear, get his fucking ass in here. Let's start shipping skoom skoom around, baby! <laughs> Let's take some of this, I guess. Fuck. All right, here, Ilya. Right behind you. Take what some do you of want this. me to carry? Let's see. I probably shouldn't have even taken that, right? Look at how heavy this is. Yeah, the the value to weight ratio, pff, awful. All right, at least it gives her something. Let's to get use. going then. Okay. And what's on you? Or any drawl? Hmm. Oh shit. <laughs> Anybody down here? I don't think so. You'd think they would have heard the commotion of two men being slain violently upstairs, <laughs> and like me screaming, like, "Hey, what's going on? What's going on? Hey, hey!" <laughs> All right. Oh, look, this is where it happens. This is where the magic fucking happens, baby. Got the moon sugar, got the scoom scoom. Mmm. Shipment's ready, it says. Let's read it. Sarthus, just got a shipment of moon sugar from Morrowind. We're refining it now, and the skooma should be ready by the time you get to Crags Lane Cavern. Bring the gold or don't show up at all. Signed, Kilnir. Oh, shit. Yoink. I know. Got some wine. Okay. Take some potatoes with my mouth. Okay, over here. Oh, so much moon sugar. Oh, my God. Ilya, check this out. We'll make a moon sugar mama out of you yet. <laughs> Let's see. I need to, like, create a sugar shack. Now, there's not nearly enough sugar in Skyrim, is there? <laughs> Good lord. There was hardly any in... Yeah, there wasn't even a, a, a drop. There was not a crumb of moon sugar in Oblivion. There was skooma, but no moon sugar, right? Oh, jeez, look at this beef. I'll take it. All right. Eat some apples. There we go. More apples to eat. Love it. Look, we even got well fed from it. Carrots. I think we can make, like, a beef stew out of carrots. Carrots, cabbage and beef, right? Take all that. Fuck me, we're getting loaded up on food shit here, huh? I've got your back. Here, Ilya. What do you want me to carry? All right, I want you to carry a shitload of food. Don't eat it, it'll make you so sick. You'll be having... <laughs> you remember when I had the really bad diarrhea? Yeah, that could be you too. <laughs> it could be you. You're next. Oh my god, I've got 56 units of salmon meat?! Ilya, we're never going to be hungry again in our fucking lives, baby! <laughs> Jeez, we just robbed the whole fucking ocean! 
Fuck. They don't live in the ocean, do they? No. They're they're freshwater. <laughs> no wait. No, yeah, yeah, they're freshwater. <laughs> That's why they're in Rifton. Yes, the Rifton, famously <laughs> ocean bordering. <laughs> Man, I'm dumb as shit. Alright, let's get on over here. It's in this barrel, some tomatoes. I'll eat them, why not? Good. More apples, delicious. Potatoes, cool. Let's see, more raw beef. Fuck me. Alright. Anything else? Jeez, you'd think this would this was like a fucking barbecue joint rather than <laughs> rather than a skooma den with all the beef. <laughs> Good lord. Where are you building, Sarthus Indrel? Fucking Arby's over here? You franchising? <laughs> Alright. Let's see, what have we got in this? Some green apples. Mmm, delicious. Sack of flour. There we are. Okay. Let's see, anything else over here? Oh look, ruined book. Some Nord mead. Little bits of gold. Anything under this wooden bowl? No, nothing. I think it got blasted away from our... It got blasted away from our battle. Take all the salt though. Eat the potatoes. Creepy head right there on your table. That's fine. Poop bucket has been thrown over. Jeez, look out, Ilya. Look out. Okay, we're in this. Green apples. Delicious. Salt. I love it. Okay. I think we found it all. Right? I think we've got everything of value. There may be some more food lurking around in here somewhere, but... Shit, maybe we don't want to fuck with that. Because we've got so much, apparently. Good lord! I didn't even, it didn't even occur to me that we had 50-something units of salmon. Fuck, the fishery. What a great place to hit up on survival mode, right? Holy fuck. Okay, let's go talk to the Jarl. Here we go. Good, good, good. Alright. You know, honestly, a fucking, like... An Arby's would have been a better cover than a strange warehouse. Jeez, what is this? What are you watching a lot of, like, old mafia movies or something? Yeah, I'll buy the abandoned warehouse. Old Sartus, that's where he always hangs out. He's passing out the goods over there. What the fuck? <laughs> How conspicuous. Alright. I guess it ultimately it didn't matter, right? It didn't matter. Because she already knew she her hands were just tied. Alright. Jarl, Lila, Layla, Lawgiver. What can I do for you? Sarthus Idrin. He's been taken care of. It's nice to receive good news for a change. Did you recover anything else from the warehouse worth mentioning? Yeah, drugs! <laughs> I discovered the source of the skooma. Moon sugar. <laughs> yeah, that's the source. Then there's no time to lose. It won't take long for Sarthus's associates to learn of his death. Oh. The source of the poison must be destroyed once and for all. Otherwise, another dealer will simply take his place. Yeah, me. Do this task for me, and you'll be well on your way to a title in Riften. Ooh. All right. I'll make sure it's done. Good. Report back to me when your task is complete. Is this like a proper quest now? No, it's still just a, a miscellaneous-ass quest. To you. Wow. I don't remember this, doing all this. Maybe I just happened through Crags Lane Cavern. The first time? Like, if you go there first, and then you talk to the Yara, will she just be like, Holy shit, you've been to Cracks Lane Cavern? Well, that- Oh, ho, 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 have I got news for you? You just want a free fucking home here in Riften? What? <laughs> Let's see. Let's take a peek. Where is this place? I don't see it flashing anywhere. Am I not tracking it? Let's see. Let's start tracking. Find the skooma dealers in Cracks Lane Cavern. Okay. Where's it at? Yeah, I still don't see it. What? Am I like tripping balls? Do I... Do my eyes deceive me? I swear if it's like on the other side of the fucking map. No. What? Do I just like not know how to track quests anymore? No, I don't. <laughs> That's the answer. I don't. I really don't. Oh, it's over here. Oh, and we still need to go speak with a neck, right? We totally do. Okay. Cool, let's turn in our Thieves Guild quest, and then we can head on out over there. Looking to stay alive. Look at this guy oh, running around. Oh, it's her fuckboy. Okay. Let's head on out over here. 
Here we are. Honestly, Mule the Lioness, you deserve it. You deserve some sort of fuckboy if you so desire. <laughs> Even though she's she's kind of high and mighty snooty, but hey. You know what? Fair enough. Okay, over here. Down into our poop hole. <laughs> hmm? Mercer Frey, check it out. I burned the bees and I got a cool Oh no wait, you're not. <laughs> Bring y'all. I did it. <laughs> I'm even furious. I told you not to burn more than three of the hives. Oh fuck. I'll smooth things over with her for now. But you can forget your cut. Oh shit. That's right. I got four of them, didn't I? I'm not even sure how I got four. I must have done some splash. I told you not to burn more than three of the hives. Am I gonna get kicked I've out? I've smoothed things over with her for now, but you can forget your cut. I've smoothed things over with her for now, but you can forget your cut. Wow, I hope you smooth things over with her for now. <laughs> Sorry, here's what was in the safe. At least you remembered one of the things I asked. Let me see that. Arangoth sold Golden Glow? What's that idiot thinking? He has no idea the extent of Maven's fury when she's been cut out of a deal. But I'm certain he'll find out. If only the parchment had the buyer's name instead of this odd symbol. Any idea what that might be? No idea. I don't even remember what it looked like, but I'm sure it was fucking weird. Blast. Well, Blast. I'll check my sources and speak to Mercer. But for now, you're off to speak to Maven Blackbriar. She asked for you by name. I think this is the first time I've heard anyone in the Elder Scrolls say blast. What the fuck? All right, good. It's about time I messed her. Uh, met, met her. Sure, but will I come out of there alive? <laughs> You'll be like, I don't know. You burnt four of the hives. Sure, but will I come out of there alive? <laughs> if it was like that, she wouldn't be asking for you. She'd be calling on the Dark Brotherhood. It's just business. What does Maven want from me? <laughs> she, she's like, oh, this this guy's good at burning shit. I need you to do some arson. <laughs> uh, ars arsony. Yeah, arsony. <laughs> Fuck, I, I'm, a, I'm a fucking off everything. Good lord, spend three hours or so <laughs> crafting and fuck, I can't do anything. <laughs> what does Maven want from me? That's between you and Maven, and I prefer to keep it that way. Just keep your ears open and your mouth shut, and you'll do fine. Yeah, okay, good luck. <laughs> I'm pretty bad at everything I fucking do. Dampen spirits. All right. Mercer Frey, I think I do got to give you the big bee, though. This better be important. I'm quite busy. Yeah, it's so important. I found this cool bee. Look at this fucking dope-ass bee statue I found. Don't you have better things to do than disturb me? No, the bee! Don't you have better things to the do bee! than disturb me? Oh my gosh, do I not have the bee anymore? I've got the queen bee statue. Oh, to Delvin. Whoops. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> All right. Let's head on over here. It's like, I don't want this stupid bee. This is just a fucking bee. What, what do I, what you want me to do with it? <laughs> of course you give it to Delvin. Of course you do. Because, well, you know. <laughs> do you like that? Delvin Mallory. Oh, you're back. Hey, Delvin, check out this fucking sweet bee statue. It's a queen bee. I don't know how I know that, but it is. Well, well. I was looking for this little beauty. Were you? If you happen to cross any other unusual trinkets like this, be sure to bring them to me. I promise it'll be worth the effort. <laughs> there you go. You fucking you weirdo. <laughs> you were looking for a fucking bee statue? Well, well. I was... Remember, Waiting for a keep it clean. Bee statue to we don't want blood in our hands. <laughs> Delvin, what is Even wrong with you? Us, you better not make trouble. It's too late. I've already made trouble. It's too late. Let's see here. Do I need to sell some weird shit off here? I think I do. Tanilia. If you're looking for extra, I give special rates to members of the Ooh, Thank goodness, Guild. her shit. Refreshed. Show me what you've got. All right, check it out. I've got amulets of sneaking. Ooh, shit. Actually, I want to hold on to that one. <laughs> How about shock resistance? I don't need that anymore. And this one. Sneaking as well. Do you like sneaking? I hope you do. <laughs> there we are. Good. Whew. All right, then. Man, whatever will I do after missing out on my cut? I don't care if you're best buddies <laughs> with the Guildmaster. I'll still smash in your skull if you try anything. Okay, okay. All I did was burn four fucking beehives. Fuck me. 
Let's see. Let's equip our old shit. Here we are. And we're good. Good, good, good. Set on back out. Wonderful. Okay, I'm thinking maybe before we hit up this shit with Maven, we do this little fun number regarding... Oh, the moment. oh shit, hang on, let's... Before we head on out, great idea. Let's stash, like, this million pounds of fish. Let's see. Oh, we gave it to what's her butt. All right. <laughs> Ilya, <laughs> here. <laughs> oh, let me take some of that care? fish. You don't need to hold, like, so many 56 units of fucking fish and beef. <laughs> there we go. Good. Horker meat as well. I, I'll take that. That's fine. <laughs> yeah, beef stew. All right. Let's get going, then. Over here. I think if we we'll just stick all this raw meat inside of here. That'll be become my thieves guild name, the the meat man. <laughs> what a terrible name. <laughs> okay, here we go. All right, and put it in there. Or maybe the I'll, I'm the butcher. No, <laughs> so many people are butchers. I need a different name. What what else would it be? Uh, marksman training. And you've got the coin. I'm ready to teach Ooh, you. I'm the Delicatessen Dunmer, baby. That's my code name. Yeah, that's right. You want some some fresh cuts? I'll give you the freshest cuts of all. Mm, you just had a meeting with the Delicatessen Dunmer, baby. Mmm. Oh yeah, it's a, it's about to get smoking here. <laughs> <laughs> or no, that would be like a smokehouse. Delicatessens don't always exclusively have like smoked meats, do they? I've never seen the old. <laughs> All right, let's head on out here. Let's go over to the whatever the fuck fucking place it is, Cra Craven Lorn Cavern, whatever. <laughs> let's get over there. <laughs> we'll do some of that, and then we can also finally turn in our quest to a neck, right? We still do have that, don't we? Let's do a double check. Yeah, tell Anek the bandit is dead. Okay. Good, good, good. Let's head on out over there. Let's do a quick save while we're at it. Oh, we should probably rest. Shouldn't we? Let's... Fuck me. Yeah, let's rest. <laughs> let's have a little bit of a rest before we head on out. Whoops. Almost forgot. I got too carried away. Too excited for a little bit of adventure. Okay. Go on over here. I cannot believe how much fish was in there. <laughs> that was so much fish. For real, 56 units of fucking fish? Are you fucking kidding me? Jeez. Man, now that we've got like a uh, fast travel unlock, well, our own personal version of it being unlocked. Now that we've personally unlocked Something fast travel to and from Riften. My God, how long does it take for that fish to come back? Like, what do we need to do? We do. <laughs> We can just come back here like every week, month, I don't know, and have like millions of fish. Jeez, limitless fish. There we are. We're good to go. Hey, good to see you. Oh, thanks, Rune. You're one of the good ones, Rune. I like you. All right. Who who are some of the the nicer ones, or at least ones with with stories that make me feel very sympathetic? Rune, Sapphire, wasn't it? And <laughs> was it just them? It wasn't just them, was it? <laughs> Certainly not that one rich asshole. Fuck that guy. All right. Okay, let's head on over here. Let's eat some of our bullshit. Salmon steak. There we are. We're satisfied. In case we have a rumble with that dragon, we can hear screaming in the distance. There we are. Over yonder. Good, good, good. Let's... Do our quick save as well. Cool. All right, and we're ready to head on over to the cavern. Goodness, we fucked around for quite a time though. So Ain't probably no when we get it. back. The thief's guild is back, and they've got Riften in their grip. Ooh, I wouldn't know anything about that. <laughs> I don't steal anything, especially not horses. <laughs> Who detects me out here? Is it the horses? Because old, old horse crusher is fucking dead. Let's see. Let's bring this up. Good. Now, if we just... If we stay on this road, we should get to where we need to be, right? Let's do it. There we are. 
You know what? I am kind of excited to fight a dragon again. It's got to be said. After all of our gear ups and stuff, I feel like that most recent crafting bout, we've had a serious jump in our survivability and probably damage just as well. We're starting to meet that singularity, right? Where the gear begins to outpace the scaling difficulty. That said, the dragons keep getting tougher and tougher up to like level 80, I think, right? I think that's the new one part of the Dragonborn or Legendary Edition, I forget. There we are. Yeah, I think it was Dragonborn DLC that added in like a level 80 dragon or whatever. Like the Ancient Dragon or Elder Dragon or some shit like that. Some just really fucking old ass dragon. I mean, they're all pretty old, right? They're all old in some way. But this one, oh my god. This one just like pees all night long. Always getting up to go pee. Good lord. This one? <laughs> this dragon? You know this dragon's fucking tough. It had fucking like 500 different colonoscopies, dude. This dragon is like tough as shit. People have been looking in this dragon's butthole for like 500 years. Good god. That is one strong, powerful dragon. Good god. I've seen that dragon's butthole. That's how strong it is. <laughs> I'm not even a doctor. <laughs> All right. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Let's get over here. <laughs> Before this dragon hears me and is like, You're talking about my anus? You're talking about my anus? <laughs> <laughs> Alduin, oh my god. People have wrote bardic tales of that man's ass. Well, that dragon's asshole. Shit. Oh! Oh! No! Ooh, I don't like this! <laughs> Ilya, where are you? This fucking bear is pissed to shit! <laughs> oh, no. oh! Am I free of it? I might be. <laughs> Fuck. Let's see. Over here. Oh shit, we need to lean to the right here. Alright. Some little fucking skeever as well. That's fine. We might be able to rumble with a fucking bear. I don't know. Jeez. Okay. Here we are. Good. Let's kind of stay up here in case we need to drop down a bit. Okay, I think we are actually just perfectly on the level. Who knows how Ilya's gonna get here, but you know what? I've got faith in her. <laughs> we should have bought her a broomstick. <laughs> so she could fly around with us. Oh man, if only we thought to do that, then we could have flying already. Right? Jeez, Ilya, you need to be flying me around. Use some of your cool witch's magic. Fly me around, holy shit. Ilya's delivery service. Man, I'll fucking pretend to be a little cat. <laughs> if that's if that's what it takes. Alright. Let's get on out over here. There we are. Stealth mode activate. I'm assuming the horse is detecting me. Look at Ilya. Stealth mode activate, Ilya. Look, we found the place. Oh, shit. Wait, are these like the dog people or what? Maybe they are. Huh. All right. Oh, jeez, man, that is... That is some sizzling fucking fajitas there on this axe. <laughs> My war axe fa of fajitas. Oh, yeah. Let's see, over here. Boom! I'm gonna cook ya! You better look out, friend. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. All right, let's heal it up over here. Ilya, get him. There we are. Cool. Good, 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 good. Roll! Eat a butt! <laughs> nope. <laughs> Eat a butt, man, for real. We fucking got him. All right. Good shit, Ilya. Holy fuck. All right. Can hear like a million other hounds baying. All right. We do have the ability that gives us the shit regen, right? I thought it would like crackle every time, or did they change that? Yeah, death blows to creatures, but not people. Trap 5% of the victim's soul, recharging the weapon. Huh. Maybe they changed the effect on it to where it no longer does that. I do not know. Alright. 
There we are. Get some restoration level. Oh, it feels nice. <sighs> okay, you know what? Hey, let's let's take these pelts. Let's check it out. There's a tanning rack right here. Oh, look at these dudes. Should we free them? I feel like we should free them and let them be free, but I'm almost positive they're going to try and kill me. Right? <laughs> what if I shut it? Can they open it? Can they open the door if I... I mean, either way, they're dead, right? Because if I leave them here, you know, role-playing-wise, they would... Someone would, like... They would either fall over dead or someone would come eat them or some shit. All right. Let's do a quick save. Let's find out. We may as well get a level out of this. Oh, shit. <laughs> But yeah, these are the dog people that were, are linked to Fallon's Tear or whatever it was. Oh, shit. Oh, God. Or Fallon's Talon. Something like that. The, the one place that we were at that had the, like, dog fighting or whatever. Oh, Shazbot. Okay. This time for sure. Uh-oh. Oh, no. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Ooh. Got it. Huh, shut it! <laughs> Nailed it. Hell you do! No! You maniac! Ooh. Ooh. Ilya, jeez. Okay, Ilya, don't... Just take it easy there, friend. <laughs> Okay. Shit. All right. Try it again. Oh, fuck. Okay, let's try it a little bit further up. Nope. I think it's a bit further down. Oh, shit. Okay. Let's try... Boom! Close it! Ooh! There we go. <laughs> Great! Oh my god, Ilya, you've opened it. Jeez. Alright, may as well take it, soul. Boom. Gotcha. No soul gem large enough. Oh, Ilya, you've got the gems. I need them. Okay, well, you know what? We're just gonna have to put them out of their misery, I guess. Poor things. Oh. Fuck me. There we go. Cool. Whew. What the fuck? Ilya. Here. I've got your back. What do you want me to carry? Are you carrying around our soul gems? Yeah, you are. Common ones and lesser ones. Good. All Let's right. get going then. Good, good, good. All right. Yep. Yeah, they got the creepy bones in here. They were feeding them people. Oh, no. What about in this sack? Let's see, cabbage, good. Do you think the heartbeat that plays whenever you cast the channeled healing? You hear that? Do you think that's that's just for fun, or is it actually supposed to be like, you know, is it meant to be reminiscent of the Elder Scrolls' most famous heart? Perhaps, I don't know. I don't know if it's essentially, if it's ever associated with healing, though, is it? Maybe. Maybe. Certainly. <laughs> certainly with buffing, right? <laughs> certainly it'll buff you up. Alright. Let's make sure we get all these pelts. Alright. Ice wolf. And plain wolf. Let's scratch these out real quick. A little scratch and sniff here. There we are. Wonderful. Good, good, good. All right. Oh shit, we're, we're encumbered. Fuck back. me, I forgot it does that. What do you want me to carry? <laughs> please, some of this trash. Please, I'm so stupid. <laughs> there we go. Wonderful. Okay. Cool. Do we have anything else we should? Nah. All right. Yeah, weird. Our our effect doesn't seem to be working. I'm not sure. Though maybe yeah, because we did fight a lot of humans there, right? I'm not sure. I have no idea. Maybe it doesn't work anymore. Maybe I broke follow. it somehow. <laughs> I thought whenever you did it, it, it would like crack and you could see it like absorb into you, right? I don't know. Okay. Well, when next we come back, we will continue on into the Crav Craven Lorne Cavern or whatever it's called. And we're going to discover 
Crags Lane Cavern. Uh, yeah, they have the best bowling pins there, but <laughs> it's bad. <laughs> we are, uh, <laughs> we're going to witness the death of comedy when <laughs> next we come back. But for now, if you'd like to stick around, if you're still alive, well, how about we do just a little bit of reading? And what shall we read this time but, well, why not The Holds of Skyrim? Why not that? Ooh, or we could read The Pirate King of the Abyssian. Fuck that, we're reading The Pirate King of the Abyssian. Fuck yes, we're doing that. We have definitely never read this, because I would remember this for sure. All right, let us begin here. Velek Sain, Pirate King of the Abyssian. Oh God, what is this? Oh, this is, oh, is this like a shanty? No, I think it's just poetry. All right. Poke out your eyes, lad. Pour lead in your ears. Those sails portend madness, dark horror, and fear. Abandon your lasses, your ship and your gold. Blood on the water, Velek this way comes. A noose from the rigging, a plank from the boards. Do yourself in, don't try at crossing swords. Mercy's not a shipmate among that heartless horde. Blood on the water, the pirate king comes. Stout empire galleon or swift elven skiff. They every one splinter and just as soon sink. But only after crew and captain have their fun. Blood on the water, your days are done. He'll tear your gut and he'll eat your heart raw. His eyes gleam red, his heart will never thaw. Mark well these words, you quaking babes. Blood on the water follows Captain Velexane. Oh, damn, Captain Velexane. Holy shit. Do you ever meet this person? No. Man, Captain Velexane sounds dope as shit. Wow, I hope those rumors about you having like some sort of uh, sailing ship in Elder Scrolls 6 turn out to be true, right? There were some like leaks that, of course, no real way to prove them, but there were some leaks about it maybe having, <laughs> you having like a, a mobile base in the form of a sailing ship. And maybe you could make it a pirate ship. Oh my goodness. All right, like I said, when next we come back, we will travel into these fun caverns and do a little bit of bowling. Until next time, please take care of each other. <laughs> <laughs>